Hi guys, welcome back to my channel Sharing Knowledge Tutorial. In this video, I am going to show you how to install Windows 98 edition, second edition, how to install on your Oracle Virtual Box. Okay, first of all, you need this Windows 98 second editions and Oracle Virtual Box. You will get this file with a inside C folder. Also, you need to win RAR lab extracted file. Okay, I will show you about that. First of all, you go to download this WinRAR. Go to you will get this all download link in this video description. Okay, and Oracle Virtual Box. Click here to select choose one. Okay, and uh, also you can see this Windows 98 download click here to select the download okay this version Windows 98 second edition OEM full okay this one inside zip folder to so go and install this version okay now you go to open this Oracle version I already installed now select new type here to Windows 90 98 you can choose SE okay and select Microsoft Windows okay you don't want to change make sure okay windows 98 already configured make sure okay click next now recommended memory size is 64 megabit now i'm choosing this okay if i want to memory next create a virtual hard disk now yes click create virtual box disk image click next dynamically allocated yes click next now asking the file location and size now I'm choosing the file location okay click here now I'm choosing volume F 98 okay click next click OK go to create now asking here to file size 2 GB I'm typing there 5 GB click create yes done it now go to settings once again go to settings go to storage and go to click on empty then you will get this option the second remaster okay now click here choose the virtual optical disk drive file yes i'm just in this windows 98 second edition okay click ok now done it now create it all you can see here you get here you here serial key also okay make sure this windows 98 second edition serial key okay go ahead on the start button click on start button now started the installation process okay now starting the installation process boot from hard disk boot from CD-ROM select a boot from CD-ROM okay Start Windows 98 setup from CD-ROM. Yes. Now starting disable scan complete. Now starting the installation process. Now you can see this. To continue with setup, press enter. Yes. Press enter. On located disk space recommended. Yes. No, you know, do you know? Do not use large disk support. Select yes. Enable the large disk support and press enter to continue press enter boot from CD-ROM is formatting C Continue press to continue press enter to create setup plus escape. Now press enter. Okay, now asking welcome to Windows 
understand the ethics setup yes click next click continue yes windows 98 setup windows 98 now i'm choosing c windows yes click next checking installed components checking for a available okay um, now setup option windows 98 setup user yes i don't want to change you i'm selecting click next typical i want setup to ensure the most common components recommended yes click next now asking computer name yes i'm typing here I'm typing here to windows 98 okay click next choose your language okay click next start copying files yes click next come to microsoft windows 98 my first favorite windows is windows 98 i like this that's why i'm remembering my old experience with 98 windows 98 more entertaining the real experience with windows 98 our system automatically going to restart Typing here Windows 98 and click next. I accept the agreement. Okay, I accept. Click next. Now asking the keyword Windows product key. Okay, okay, finish. First, I told you about a serial key, you will get there. Okay, and type there serial key and click next. Okay, now finish. Now setting up hardware, hardware detection, remaining 14 minutes, yes, yeah, in seconds, Windows 98 is the restart computer, okay, so if we start now, you don't want press, okay, Windows configuring automatically, yeah, setting up hardware and plug and play, devices you may have, time zone okay you select the time zone okay now control panel okay now restarting computer you don't want press any things after you remove your ASO file, then automatically starting in the Windows. Okay, now inside the ASO file, that's why he's asking again, again, again the option. Press continuity key, press any continuity key, Windows. Okay, yes, press. Now starting. Now I don't want password. Unknown devices, new hardware, default monitor, Windows is installing the software, okay, updating system settings. Yeah. Yes. Now done it. You can see Windows. Welcome to Windows 98. Done it. I remember in my old and first experience. You can see show the screen each time windows 98 starts i don't want any times close done it you can see here windows update favorite everything i hope you like this video if you like this video make sure hit like and share now one more thing sorry for the late more things I will show you about this. You can see this 
Aí é seu. Ok. Could you close the city? You can see this here. Now I already added in this ISO file. Now I'm going to Windows 986 driver. You can see here this folder is I already added with the ISO file. Modern driver will be X. Yes. It is the display driver. Okay. Now I will show you about this. Minimize this. Okay, now I'm going to this display display driver. Then you can see here go to the display driver. Click on display driver, standard PC, Apple standard PC, and select the driver. Click update the driver, go to next, next, CD drive, specific 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 location. Now I have already there. All in my. You can see here Windows 98. Now I'm going to I will show you about the Windows 98 AC driver. Now you can see this. VBA9X okay for VBA 9X plus okay and select this okay you can see this then we will get this option okay and click OK click next and click next now already installed system asking the do you want to restart now computer yes i'm clicking restart then you can see this effect you don't want the system automatically okay physical computer now this one also is an older display driver in 95 okay using with 98 or another one also the model driver you get also is DirectX yes games games This one you know, yeah. You can see this company in the commercial. Okay, I don't want now. Here, the DirectX X drive. Information database. 
I hope you like this video. If you like this video, please. If you like this video, please make sure you like and share. Your contribution is more confidence. If you have any issues, please comment below. Please don't forget to subscribe my channel. Once again, thanks for watching and subscribing. See you next video. Bye. Take care. You will get this all link in this video description. Okay. Bye. Take care. See you next video.